this HTV News Show, we have details on Decades Day, the All School Dance, and the We Care Drive. All this and more coming up on this Thursday, May 11, 2023, Gold Day edition of the HTV News Show. Let's start. Hello, Crocker, and welcome to today's HTV. This is Amanda. And I'm Claudia. Let's go over to our top story. The last day of cast type stay is tomorrow. Remember to bring a charged Chromebook, eat a good breakfast, and get plenty of sleep. Do your best on these tests as they will help us plan for next year. Today is the minimum day gold day, period 1 to 3. Tomorrow is also a gold day, period 4 to 6. Eighth graders will be taking the science cast in your science class next week. Mother's Day is coming up on Sunday. Do you have a card telling... Do you have a card telling your mom how much you appreciate her? It'll be a nice weekend with lots of sunny weather. Make sure you plan something special for your mom on Sunday. This week is Teacher Appreciation Week. Make sure to thank your teachers. We had a teacher appreciation car wash and fun games in the office all week. It was great. We also had a fantastic teacher appreciation lunch last Thursday, run by the parent group, which which was spectacular. Thank you, Senorita Norris, for teaching us how to speak a foreign language and keeping the class engaging. I've learned a lot in the last year, all thanks to you. Thank you, Ms. D, for making social studies fun. You really brought out the historian in me, and I've always looked forward to your class. Thank you, Mr. Hager, for teaching me how to use DaVinci Resolve. I enjoy editing videos and recording in this awesome class. I really enjoyed doing blackout poetry in English class last year. Thank you for making poetry fun, Mrs. Thank you for being such a great teacher, Ms. Shakawazi. You have taught me so much this year. Thank you very much. I have really enjoyed being in your class this year, Mr. Carroll. You have taught me so many things and made every day super fun, especially with Mr. Nikki and Team Jeopardy. Thank you so much, Ms. Doris, for making your class awesome. I really enjoyed being in your Yosemite group this year and I hope I can be in your class next year. Thank you for being such a helpful teacher to me. When I have a question, you are always there to guide me through my work. I really enjoyed being in, in your sewing class and math class. I learned so much from your classes and I hope I am able to have you as a teacher next year. Learning about the dynasties, the Renaissance period, and civilizations with Mrs. Fairchild was awesome. Thank you for making every topic in class interesting with amazing stories and projects. Thanks to Ms. Morgenstern for making learning more fun and engaging. I really enjoyed your class. Thank you, Ms. Mendy, for being an amazing leadership teacher. Over the last two years, I really enjoyed planning events and learning leadership skills. Thank you. And I would like to thank Ms. Torello for being extremely nice and preparing me for high school. Thank you for two years of social studies. And remember, sixth period was the best class ever. Thank you, Ms. Indike, for teaching me all about twenty twenty guide reading. I enjoy taking quizzes in your class. You're a great teacher. Thank you so much, Mr. Hager. I had so much fun in HTV and electronics and computers. I love learning your class, and you're such a great teacher. I have learned so much about editing and creating videos. It's an honor to be one of your students. Thank you, Ms. Shayu, for being a wonderful teacher and teaching me lots of Mandarin. I really enjoyed learning all the characters and being one of your students. You are super kind, and you're one of the best teachers I have had. Thank you for being a great teacher. Thank you, Ms. Song, for all the fun activities we did in math. I learned a lot in your class and loved going to sixth period math last year. Thank you, Ms. Woods. I had a great time this class year. I loved all the fun activities in your class. I learned a lot and had a great time. Thank you so much, Mr. Collins. Your class is so fun and you've helped me so much this year. Thank you so much for being the best English teacher ever. Thank you so much, Mr. Manu, for making PE so much fun. You are very encouraging when I run the mile, pacer, or any of the fitness tests. I learned so much about physical education because you were my teacher. Mr. Collins, you've been such a great teacher in my sixth grade year. It is so fun to talk to you about sports, English class, and helping you with my essays. Thank you for being my chaperone at Yosemite, and thank you for being such a nice person. Happy Teacher Appreciation Week. Thank you for being an awesome teacher, Ms. Woods. I really enjoyed having you as an English teacher. Your attitude every day is really fun and exciting. You are also a fun flex teacher, and I really like how positive you are and, and being nice to everybody. Some people are having birthdays this, this week, so make sure to wish them a happy birthday. Lexi, Ethan, Andrew, Jacob, Bruce, Taylor, Ava, and Ryan. Have a great birthday. Tomorrow, there is going to be an all-school dance. This means sixth, seventh, and eighth graders are all invited. What's up, Vikings? It's Ava, and I'm here to tell you about the upcoming dance on Friday, May 12th. This dance will be taking place in the NPR from 6 to 8 p.m., and all grades are welcome. The theme will be A Night in the City, and you can get tickets this week during recess. See you there!
This week, the weather has been warming up to the high 60s and low 50s at night. The sky has been pretty clear and the rain seems to be going away. Enjoy the weather, Crocker, because this weekend the temperature is going to rise to the high 70s. Decades Day is tomorrow, so make sure to dress up to support your class. If you're in 6th grade, you'll be dressing up in, in 60s fashion. If you're in 7th grade, you'll be dressing up in 70s fashion. And if you're in 8th grade, you'll be dressing up in 80s fashion. In order to count as a point, you need to be wearing at least two articles of clothing. There is also a class competition during lunch recess, which is a relay race. Make sure to come over to the gym for the competition. Hi, Crocker Vikings. Tomorrow is Decades Day. Sixth graders, make sure to wear at least two items of 60s gear. Seventh graders, wear 70s gear. And eighth graders, wear 80s gear. Make sure to show your spirit on Decades Day this Friday. Today, sixth graders have intramurals. Game one will be Team Phoenix versus Team Levi Leviathan. And game two will be the Ghosts versus the Giants. Good luck, Warball teams. The Be Care Drive is coming up. It will go from May 15th up until the 19th. Please bring supplies if you can, as it will help um, families in need. Please bring in some non-perishable foods. This is your last chance to earn class competition points. The soccer competition called the Champion League's first match of the semifinals happened last Tuesday with Real Madrid and Manchester City. Often regarded as the two best teams in the world, recently competing with a draw of one to one. The next game will be the ne will be next Tuesday with AC Milan pitting off against Inter Milan as an in an Italian rivalry showdown. There will be a band concert next later next week on Tuesday the sixteenth. In addition to this, band will also be taking a trip to Disneyland on Wednesday, May seventeenth. Make sure to tune into the concert, Crocker. End of the year materials will be collected soon. Make sure you turn in all your library books, textbooks, loaners, and Chromebooks. Please see Mr. Hager for any Chromebook issues, and all these must be turned in in order to receive your yearbook. And to end this show, we caught up with more students to hear why they are thankful for the wonderful teachers at our school. Take it away. I really enjoyed being in your Yosemite group, Miss Slater, and had so much fun with you. You are so kind, fun, and amazing. I will never forget the week we spent talking about CPK and going on hikes. Thank you for everything you do. Thank you, Miss Woods, for letting me enjoy this amazing school year with you. I love how you helped me focus in class, and you're super positive, and I like your excitement mood every day. I hope I have you in seventh grade, and I hope you have an amazing summer and a school year. Thank you. Thank you, Ms. Giacomazzi, for being the best science teacher ever. I like how you let us do lots of experiments and let us sit where we want. When I walk into class, I always have a smile on my face. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Chima, for making science really interesting and fun through numerous experiments and explorations. I really enjoyed making the Newton scooters and the scope about the solar system. Thank you, Mr. Bounce, for always giving everyone tips during chess club. I think that I've learned a lot from these tips, and I'm excited to learn more. Thank you, Mr. Halperin. I love it when you're my substitute teacher, and I, you always make my classes more fun. I also enjoy how well you communicate with your classes. Thank you, Mrs. Xiaoyu. You teach Mandarin really well and make it fun for everyone. You also help me and others when, uh, when they're struggling in speaking, reading, or any other problem. I have a great time in your class, and I'm sure others do, too. Uh, thank you, Mr. Bounce, for being such a good science teacher. I really like your class, and you are a good teacher. Uh, happy Teacher Appreciation Week. Thank you, thank you, Mrs. Auerbach, for helping me with math for the last couple of trimesters. You've made me a better student and like the quotes you share. You have also helped me with my math. It's helped me get better at it. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Chima. You're an outstanding public speaking teacher. You were very funny and you taught me a lot about how to write speeches. Thank you, Miss Lee, for being such a great teacher. I love how you're so patient and really encouraging. Whenever I need your help, you're always there to teach me new ways of answering a problem. I'm so happy to be in your class this year. Thank you so much, Mr. Bounce, for being an awesome teacher. I always liked how you give us really good experiments to do while we are in class. And because of your energetic mood, it makes me look forward to science every day. I really enjoy being in your class, and happy Teacher Appreciation Week. Thank you so much, Mr. Collins, for being an amazing English teacher and helping with work. Also, for not giving much homework so we aren't really overwhelmed with work every day. Thank you so much, Mr. Hager, for being an awesome teacher. I enjoy HD100, and I have learned so much about filming and editing in your class. I'm glad that I picked HD100 this year as an elective. 
Thank you, thank you, Mr. Collins, for being so nice and amazing English teacher and making Yosemite an excellent experience. Thank you for putting in all the work to make us learn English. Thank you very much. Thank you so much, Mrs. Morgenstern, for always being very positive. I really enjoy the class brain breaks that you often have. Happy Teacher Appreciation Week. Thank you, Ms. Ong, for being an amazing math teacher. I always enjoy fifth period with you. You make math fun and enjoyable. Thank you so much, Mr. Cable, for being the best teacher. Thank you for making social studies so much fun and for teaching me about history and being my first period teacher. Thank you, Mr. Bounds, for helping me enjoy learning about science much more than before. You always find some way to make class interesting and the activities we do are always fun. Thank you so much, Mr. Berry. You are such a good teacher. It is so fun being in your class. I really grown in my athletic capability with the help of with the help of you it has been really fun in your class and I've gotten many of my goals with the help of your teaching thank you so much mr. Bowie, and have a great teacher appreciation week thank you so much miss woods for making English so fun I always enjoy being in your class I love your energy and how you can always make everyone in the class laugh I love how you always joke around with us. I've learned so much in the class, and I hope I have you next year. Thank you for being an awesome teacher. Thank you, Senorita Norris. You're such an amazing Spanish teacher, and I've learned so much from you, from your class. You are very kind and compassionate, and one of the best teachers I have ever had. Just want to express my deep gratitude for the dedicated work you do day after day. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Mr. Bowie, for pushing me in athletic development. You made me more fit and I learned a lot of new exercises and it was fun to hear about what was happening with your football team. Again, thank you so much for boosting my athletic abilities and making it fun at the same time. Thank you for watching today's show. Bye, Crockers!